It's a very pleasant evening here in Chennai and we're back at the M.A. Chitamram Stadium for the big final, the TNPL 2019. Chepok Supergili is taking on Dindical Dragons. Toss happened a little while earlier. It was the Chepok Supergillies that won the toss. No hesitation in deciding to bat first. That's the way they've been. Put runs on the board and had a lot of success. Ganga Sridhar Raju. Gopinath has made consistent contributions right through the tournament. Jagannath and Kaushik is being given the new ball. A little bit of swing and that's good bounce. This is it up. This could be the first chance. Silam Butterson takes it. The first wicket is down. Gopinath, the big player as well. He's gone first ball. You've got to remember it's a different menu when you play in Chennai. You're not going to have the wind assistance. You're not going to have the small boundaries. Gopinath, the man dismissed. One for one. Koshik Gandhi, the skipper, walks out with his side and under early pressure. Oh, that's in the air too. Is that the first maximum? It's a sucker cement maximum. And a great way to finish the third over. Shot over mid wicket. In the air and out. Ganga Srida Yabraju gone. A good catch at point. He's gone for four, Ganga Sridharaju. It's 18 for two. The biggest name player on show this evening. Vijay Shankar. Edge and taken, is it? Oh, I think this is carried. Jagadeesan's got a beauty. And it's a huge moment in the game. Soft signal is out. Super, super catch that. Splendid catch that. Wicket number three has gone down. It's Vijay Shankar, who's back in the pavilion, 19 for three. Sushil at number five. Another outside edge, third man's wide. He can't get there. Much needed boundary for the Super Gillies. Oh, that's a great shot. Great shot, a low risk shot. Well, he's gone over the offside. What a shot that is. Well, this time through the offside, it could be a chance. He has taken it, and Mohamed. And he struck again as he did in the last match. Tactically, that is great bowling. 43 for four. Sassadev in at number six. Oh, swung away. And that's fine enough to go for a boundary. We get through uh, this year. Wonderful. But tonight's captain is Jagadeesan. I think another wicket down for the Chepok Supergill. He's back to the com box. Tossed it up beautifully. That's what I love. The ball to spin in the air and turn off the pitch. An easy stumping for Jagadeesan behind the stumps. So well set. Sushil has to walk back to the pavilion. Burgan Ashwin comes out to bat. He's a capable player. That's a boundary, that's a beautiful shot. Struck it cleanly and beautifully as well. How often have we seen when you target the side screen, you get good value for your shots. It's a Sankasam in maximum. See, timed it well enough. There is long on in position, but it's a good hit. That's the way to do it. She know exactly where the fielders are. And this particular shot doesn't matter where the fielders are. It's high and it's long as well. Magnificent shot. Getting underneath the ball, getting the elevation, and getting a sunk cement. Super six. Or oh, straight. That is so well timed. Very, very well bowled. Hey, is he a gonna? Yep, a direct hit from Jagadeesan. And Sasi Dev doesn't even wait for the umpire Mother Gopal to be given out. He's walking back to the pavilion. Sasi Dev, 44, outstanding. 116 for six. Harish Kumar is the new man at the crease. Long on. Jazz goes over him. Nice way to start the over. 
Sankasim in maximum. Coming from the bat of Murgadashvin. Oh, he's got to run, he's got to run. He's going to be run out. Murugan Ashwin not interested in Harish Kumar. Walks back for just a single. Taking his eyes on the ball, doing everything that was not correct. But in the end, the easy dismissal. Two deliveries remaining. Harish Kumar, the man dismissed. Siddharth in at number nine. Dear, oh dear, he thought it was a bye, he left it alone, then looking for a bye, he's gone. 20 hours bold and they will finish. The Chebox Subagilis winning the toss and batting first, 126 for 8. I'm not sure why you're leaving the delivery. In any case, there will be set up, run out without facing a ball. They will finish the 20 overs at 126. The good news, the runs are on the board. And it is now up to the Dindigal Dragons to go and get them. They don't have as many as they would want. But still, in a final, anything can happen. We are back for the second innings. The run chase in this year's TNPL final. The player that impressed Shane Watson, Hari Nishant. Along with the skipper Jagadeesan out there to open up. Vijay Shankar will get the new ball. He swung the ball nicely in the playoff game so far. Slip in place. Oh, big shout. Was it big shout? He was on the money straight away. Out! There it is! The pressure told. Eight dot balls. Jagged Deason looking to go over the offside and has taken a point. The skipper goes for a duck. It's none for one. And a man who hasn't had a great tournament. He was brilliant in qualifier number two. Chaturved, but that has been about it. Big shout, big shout, give it! Chatterman, it's gone, it's two! Dear, oh dear, what are we getting? A low scoring thriller again. Two wickets in an over, and he does that very, very often. Chaturved has also gone for a duck, it's none for two. Two overs, no runs. Two wickets down, and Sumant Jain. Beautiful, the bottom man coming into play, majestic this. Short and it's out, it's out. Yes, it is. The Terry Nishan, that's three down. Straight to Siddharth. Target 127, but really a game on. Four for three. Mohan Abina. Well, that's cut away and it's in the gap, too. He was disappointed with the previous delivery, but this one gets punished. In the air, this could be a six. Oh, that's much needed. Massive sunk of cement maximum. Good aim from Simon Jane. Timed, timed well enough. Yes, sunk of cement maximum. Well, they need a lot more of these. Oh, has he taken it? I think this is carried. Soft signal is out. Giving the charge into the ribcage. Did that carry? Yep, carry it. My naked eye, my old eyes, says it carry it. And a big moment too. Abby now after the big six in the last over. Heads back to the pavilion for 21. It's 53 for four. Often seen. Batting at number three after a good start, it is the powerful Vivek, Vivek Raj. Well, that is powerful. It was worth them. We'll run away. The boundaries keep flying. And they still get the boundary. Yes, it is. There's your six. You called it, LS. Sunk a cement maximum. Very good way to start the over. It's getting to be a very, very interesting match. There we go. Easy as you like. Sanka Shemit maximum. Wow. This is getting very, very interesting. Now there's going to be pressure on the bowling side. Spanked. Half volley. 
One bounce as well. They keep finding the boundary. Vivek again. He's done it. Field is up. And that may well have carried all the way. Was it a half volley or not? And Boy says it's a six. I'm not sure I agree with him, to be honest, but I'm sure they'll go up and check. I think you're right, Scotty, but probably it's a boundary there. Yeah, I think it's a boundary. So the ball boy and me both are wrong. <laughs> and he's got him here. What a decision. Sushil has picked up the stunning catch. And maybe, just maybe, that wicket of Vivek changes things for the Super Gillies. Vivek Raj goes for the cameo. Vivek gone. Now it's M. Mohamed. Oh, that's in the gap. That will be a boundary. They just keep coming. A little too quick, the bowling from Alexander. Oh, no timing. This is in the air. Hadesh Kumar, he was supposed to be at the bowling crease, but he takes the catch nonetheless. And R. Alexander picks up his second. So he goes for 46, Summon Jane. 47 deliveries, so it's 104 for six. Rohit Ramalingam. Oh, it's through the legs. Will run away as well. They'll get a boundary, will they? Yeah, they will. The tournament comes down to this. Another tournament this year where 15 is needed off the last over. He's got it, has he? No, it's straight down the throat. That's a big catch, Vijay Shankar. Most importantly, it's a dot ball as well. Penny Asami keeps getting bigger, bigger, bigger. Penny Asami. Imamid out for a 15. And it will be the Pradesh more known for his bowling than his batting. Straight up. Straight up. This could be another one. Sasadev takes it easily. And he's on a hat trick. This is just unbelievable. Pradesh Sami is getting better and better with every ball. Go hit for two. 112 for eight. He was outstanding with the ball, Jay Koshik. That should be it. That should be it. Stay behind the line. Foot behind the line. Petty Swami, 14 now off two. Bonnie! And a five wicket all for Petty Swami. An amazing over, and it's not over yet. And he's got his fifth wicket, I reckon, yeah. Piriya Sami has got his fifth wicket. Only one wicket left, and it's 14 runs needed. 113 for nine. And that means Silam Butterson is in to face the final ball. It's the last ball. And that's it. That's the moment everybody is waiting for. And champions for the second time, Chepok Super Gillies 2019. What a way they defended this target. 126. Everybody thought that's it. It's going to be Dundakal Dragons going to win the title for the first time this year, but it's not going to be. Chepok Super Gillies has bounced back yet again. Out of the four times, four editions, they have come to finals thrice. Once runner, twice winner. What a performance from Chepok Super Gillies. Um, Look at the way they have defended. Chepok has won by 12 runs. And they deserved it. Congratulations. Well, the winning team and their captain, Kaushik Gandhi, is the winning captain. And the Chepok Super Gillies are the winners of the TNPL 2019. Well deserved victory too for the Chipok Super Gillies. They knocked over the top of the table, Dindigal Dragons in the qualifier, and they repeated the dose in the TMPL final. And they are the two time champions of the Sunka Cement TNPL. Koshik Gandhi leading the side, did a brilliant job. And quite understandably, they are celebrating as they should.